Welcome, welcome back, guys, to Travis Custom Detailing. It's me, Mario, again. So today I'm going to show you guys what kind of pressure washer is, well, acceptable when you're doing automotive detailing. I'm going to do this under five minutes so you guys won't get overreactive or whatever. So let's just say we want a pressure washer, right? What kind and what are you looking for when you're getting one? So uh, there's one called Greenworks out there that you can find out in uh, Lowe's. And they typically look sort of, well, let me go over here then, put pressure washer because they make a lot of stuff. So we can look at this real quick. You have your regulars like this one right here. This one right here is their certified one. What do you do, right? So cost 179 bucks. But what are you really looking into when you're buying a pressure washer, right? So a pressure washer works off of two things. It works off of pressure and how much flow or water comes out of it. So if you look at this right here, it says 1,800 PSI, that's how much pressure comes out, and 1.2 gallons per minute. To tell you the truth, that's not a lot of flow, water coming out of it. But if you're using this just to tank around your house, a little bit of projects it's good it's also good for a beginner when you're you doing it for an automotive detailing business it's all right okay now there's another way you can look into this and that is going into this website called obsessed garage now this guy right here he knows what he's talking about he has various types of pressure washers that are available from the high end down to the low end to the middle way to the middle level he shows you how good they are he shows you the prices he even tells you which ones are the best and which ones totally suck now on the other hand too he also has a spreadsheet that shows each pressure washer that he tested individually from the Kranzlas, which are very nice comets greenworks ryobi's and it tells you everything that you need to know from PSI, flow, and pressure uses, and it recommends you how to make it better by using different nozzle sizes. So this is a way to find which one's better for you. If you're an enthusiast and you like the expense stuff, yeah, go ahead, buy your Kranzler. You know, spend the money. You like it. But if you're really running a business and you want something cheap, it doesn't matter. I'll, I'll go with Greenworks, Ryobi, whatever, and just, you know, pump out money. It is what it is, right? So hopefully this video shows you what to choose from a pressure washer and what to look out for of your needs and your wants. So hope this helps. This is again Mario signing off again. Continue to subscribe for this channel. And yes, I am back. And let's keep on going. So. Next time I'll see you I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.